Good Tuesday, everyone. Our weather map for today shows lots of showers across the eastern portion of the U.S., and those showers will be building and developing as we go through the day. You might even hear some rumbles of thunder out there. No severe weather is expected today, though. Looking farther to the west, we see more snowflakes flying across portions of the Rockies, so that system does seem to be winding down just a bit. Look at our five-day forecast brought to you by Clearview Closet and Blind. 90% chance of rain today. As we go through the day, you'll see that rain developing highs in the mid-60s. South winds 10 to 15, gusting to 20. Wednesday, 30 to 50% chance for showers the first half of the day. The afternoon and evening are looking pretty good. Highs in the low 60s. Thursday, mostly cloudy. Highs in the mid to upper 60s. Friday, more rain and storms blowing in here. And those will stick with us through Saturday as it looks right now. Highs around 60 and lows around 50 Friday night. But then the cold front comes through on Saturday, which is the culprit for the showers and thunderstorms both of those days. And that drops us down to the low 30s by Saturday night. So it looks like we'll have some uh, patchy frost around the area. Sunday morning, and then looks like uh, looking ahead just a bit, Monday morning's looking uh, frosty as well. We all know we're going to bout to frost um, from here till whenever. <laughs> that, can, that can be with us for a while. <laughs> so, but, uh, but no bitter cold temperatures in sight, and certainly no wintry precipitation in sight. And looking at our threat graph brought to us by Premier Generators, um, Tuesday through Saturday, there are no current threats. Um, I keep an eye on things this time of the year as closely as I can, but just not looking at anything much from our system today, from the system that's coming through today and tomorrow, and not looking like much of a threat right now from the system coming in Friday and Saturday. Looks like those threats will stay to our south, but um, I'll continue to keep an eye on things, but right now things are looking pretty good. On this day in 1955, things were not looking pretty good. Middle Tennessee was hit by two tornadoes. An F1 in Carthage injured three. And then F2 touches down in southeast Wilson County and skips for 20 miles, crossing into DeKalb County, hitting Alexandria and Temperance Hall. No injuries reported. 1960. We weren't worried about severe weather in 1960 because our temperature dipped to two below zero at Crossville. Setting a new record for the month. I don't know about you all, but I'll take our morning lows in the 50s this morning over that negative two. I'm done with negative numbers after the uh, winter storm we had back in January. <laughs> you folks have a wonderful Tuesday. Thank you for looking up. For more weather information, meteorologistmark.com.